Patronage is an important aspect of medieval art across all cultures. Sometimes we have no idea about who commissioned or paid for a work of art. Sometimes we just have a name. In some cases, we know quite a lot. And one of my favorite works in the book is in this last category. The Hermitage of St. Neophytos is a complex of small rooms carved into a cliff in Cyprus in the 12th century by an Orthodox monk named Neophytos. We know about him from the foundation document that he wrote in Greek because the Hermitage became a small monastery for men who wanted to live close to this pious founder. Neophytos began carving out the Hermitage in 1159. There's a private cell with a bed and an altar and a tomb. There's a church with a worship space and a sanctuary separated by an icon screen. And above the church, Neophytos carved out a small space private space from which he could look down on the church services. Several of the wall paintings show Neophytos as a bearded elderly man. In his cell we see him kneeling at the feet of Christ with John the Baptist and Mary praying for his uh, entry into heaven. In the sanctuary he is being escorted bodily upward and when the monks looked up at the painting of the ascension of Christ to heaven in the ceiling of the church, they would often see Neophytos' actual face peering down from his private space. So the images are a, a visual fulfillment of Neophytos' prayers. After death, he hoped to be saved. He hoped to become a member of Christ's heavenly court, and the paintings actively promote his case.